Hi guys, it's Micah. Today I'm back with the Use and Hoard Your Stash series. It's number 30. And I made a Halloween-ish card. <laughs> it doesn't say Happy Halloween. And I'm sorry, you can see I, I, my camera didn't record the first bit and it zoomed out. Don't know why. I had to change battery as well, so maybe something went there. But um, yeah, it, it just layering colors with watercolor on watercolor paper, which is... I have a very big panel, it's about tw twice the size of a card panel. And then I can choose which bits I want to use. And I'm just, you know, applying blues and indigo and uh, there's a little bit of teal underneath. Which I thought could look <laughs> like the ground, but it didn't. My bats are floating, basically. But yeah, it's fine. <laughs> they fly, don't they? Probably not with the picket fence, but yeah, you know what I mean. That's so cute. It's a Digi from Digi Doodle Studios. Digi Doodle Studios. I'm sorry. And um, the yeah, this link down below. I'm spritzing it with the Shimmer Spritz Sparkle version. No stars. <laughs> no splattering. Wow. I exceeded myself there. No. <laughs> I wanted to shimmer because there's otherwise maybe not enough interest. I don't know. I like it, but you know, this way it's it's nice and sparkly. And the bigger dots might be stars anyway. And I left it bigger so I could choose the best bit of watercoloring, and I don't know yet. But for now, I am going to color this. I already cut it out with my skin cut. Turn on the music and talk to you in a little bit. <laughs> Enjoy.
The example on the DigiDoodle website had purple bats, and I like purple, so I stuck with that. But I checked after coloring that, um, well, I assume the website owner uh, colored the ears on the outside the same as the wings. I, in Copics I don't have all the blacks or cool grays or whatnot, so I went with, with, with the really dark purple, which looks gray anyway, and I like it. Uh, yeah, I'm cutting down the size first. I'm cutting off the bits that are hmm, not suitable, where there's no paint. And I, I put on the card blank just to see if I could do portrait or landscape. I had to be landscape because it didn't fit otherwise. And I'm cutting it to size, and I have this little oh shiny. Yeah, it's in a bin, but <laughs> I need to find a way to use it. And uh, the tape runner for the watercolor paper. And then I'm mounting the cutout with bats in. Uh, or with foam. Sorry. I'm not sure what I'm trying to say. <laughs> and I, oh yeah, the Digi on the website, well, you can see if you go look, has a green moon and. Black picket fence. I went blue, so I thought I went nice with the background. And the green moon is probably for the Halloween colors, purple, orange, green. But I went with warm grays and uh, no craters because they <laughs> nope. <laughs> so that's my card, and thank you for watching. I hope to see you again soon. Bye.